Hello everyone and welcome to the Pippins post game show presented by Cascade Natural Gas. I'm Chris Rosado Jr. It's a big win for the Pippins in their non-league finale against the Highline Bears 22 to 2, the largest win margin for them this season, capped off by a big triple by none other than pitcher Kenny Johnson. You do not want to miss this when we come back. Be an energy efficiency hero. Install high efficiency natural gas equipment and be just like Cascade's most energy efficient player of the game. Match his ERA of $710. Check out our incentives now. Pippins, go ahead and uh, throw out a pitcher to hit here in the bottom of the eighth. Last chance for the Pippins to add to their lead unless something catastrophic happens in the ninth. And Johnson lines this one into deep right field. Racing back is the right fielder. It's over his head and to the wall. Johnson high-stepping his way into second. He's going for three. The relay goes to third, and it hits him on the back. He slides into third. It is an RBI triple for Kenny Johnson. And the Pippins are ahead 21-2 to two in the bottom of the eighth inning. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the Pippins Post Game Show presented by Cascade Natural Gas. I'm Chris Rosado Jr. talking with tonight's Cascade Natural Gas high efficiency player of the game, Kenny Johnson. You can't get much more efficient than one hit in one at bat, and what a hit for Kenny Johnson. He does the unthinkable, blasts one over the head of the right fielder, sprints all the way around for a triple. Kenny Johnson, how are you feeling right now after your first college hit? I feel pretty ecstatic. I mean, it's nice. It's good. I liked it. So take me through that at bat. Walk me through the pitches you were working through. You're battling through. Took a couple of close pitches, low and away. Swung at one, low and away. Tell me what you were looking for uh, after you got to that point in the at bat, and and how the at bat developed for you. Well, I was looking for a first pitch fastball, and he threw it in the dirt. And then I was just pretty much swinging every pitch. I mean, <laughs> I don't. I have no approach up there. And then when I got to two strikes, I just I didn't want to strike out, so I just. Anything close, I'd swung. And you got the bat on the <laughs> ball in a, a quite a good way. Kenny Johnson, a two-time Cascade Natural Gas High Efficiency Player of the Game, and now our first two-way Cascade Natural Gas High Efficiency Player of the Game. Got it for a start on the mound uh, earlier in the year, much earlier in the year, and now gets it as a pinch hitter in the bottom of the eighth. Hits a triple, scores a run, and then ends up tagging up to score on a sacrifice fly. Gives the Pippins a 22 to two victory over the Highline Bears. You guys are now undefeated 11-0 in non-league play as you finish your non-league stretch. You get two days off and you take off for Corvallis on Tuesday. How are you feeling uh, with the momentum starting to build up again going into this series in Corvallis? Yeah, we feel good. I mean, going to Corvallis, that's probably who we're gonna face in the playoffs, the championship. So just gotta be ready, locked in, and let's go. Ready and locked in, the Pippins are, and they hope to continue as they head into Corvallis. It's Players Weekend. Kenny Johnson with Ken Dog on the back of his jersey, making Ken and Lisa proud at home. He's our Cascade Natural Gas High Efficiency Player of the Game. I've been Chris Rosado Jr. Thanks for tuning in.